What is going on guys? It's me Vince again with another video and today I'm actually going to be installing an item that I've been procrastinating on installing for about I would say four to five months now. I've got I got this item from the event that was uh, hosted by OC Overland and Yoda Mafia I'd say about August or September last year and it's been January now so you know I, <laughs> it's just been sitting in my garage and the reason why I've, uh, I've been holding off on installing it is because I'm not really good with elec uh, you know, electrical stuff you know I always get intimidated when you know there's a lot of wires involved in installing an item but um, after watching some videos recently and I actually went through the manual or the install guide that was provided in the box and after looking at it I realized it's actually really easy it's a totally plug-and-play um, item and what I'm actually talking about is this one right here so it's an I um, it's a product by Yoda Mafia and these are their um, true plug-and-play rock lights so like I said I have watched their video and I actually went through the install guide that was provided in this box and I realized it's actually really really simple so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm actually gonna go through the process of installing it um, I'm gonna show you guys how to install it especially the wiring part of it and enough said let's get to the process so when you open the box these are pretty much what's gonna be in it um, so you're gonna have your manual or your instruction guide um, you're gonna have four of these uh, KC Cyclones they're flood white I believe and you're gonna have this plug um, that goes inside your cab this is the relay um, you're gonna have two wiring harnesses one for the front which is the short one and another one going towards the rear which is the longer one and you're gonna have some of your um, bolts and hardwares so that's pretty much it so right now we're at the uh, front passenger side uh, fender well um, so in so in installing this rock light you'll see a little rubber gasket here all you have to do is just pull it out and that's where your rock light pretty much will sit so once you remove the rubber gasket here um, what you're gonna do is just make a little hole right beside it and that hole is where you're gonna be feeding these wires so as you can see on the passenger side there's the hole right there and for you to be able to drill a little hole beside it um, I would recommend removing this horn so just try to unbolt this one so that you'll have more space to drill on that side now that you made a hole all you have to do is just put this rubber gasket that was provided in the package portion of our truck um, so what you're gonna do is pretty much from this indentation right here you're gonna measure five inches towards the back and you're gonna measure one and a half inches from this side going in and then you're just gonna make a little hole I mean make a little mark there and that's where you're gonna be uh, drilling a hole for you to mount 
the Casey Cyclops. And now for the wiring part of this install, um, like I said earlier, you have two wiring harnesses. One is for the back and one is for the front. So the back part, um, if you're going to open it up, one end will have this Y connection here. So this small or short part here goes to the rear passenger side. I mean, I'm sorry, rear driver side. And then the slightly longer one is going to the rear passenger side. And the other side or the other end of the wiring harness it will just route it all the way to your um, engine bay. So for the front part of this wiring, um, you're gonna have this short wiring harness that was provided. So one end, the longer end, goes to the front passenger side. And on the other end, you have several connections. So. This one goes to right here. So this one goes to the driver side. Um, this one connects to the wiring harness that you routed all the way from the back. And then this one right here, this connects to the blue part of your relay. And this one just um, is a negative. So you, what you're gonna do is. Um, tap this on the bolt that I'll be showing you guys later. So this will be the fuse that um, Yoda Mafia will provide you. So right here you're gonna have the red wire. This will be tapped directly to the positive port of your battery. The blue wire right here, this is the blue wire that I was talking to you, uh, you guys about earlier where the red wire from your wiring harness will connect and then the black wire right here you're gonna put it on the side and this one will be the one that you're gonna be routing all the way inside your cab so this relay right here first you're gonna have to remove the fuse just like so and put it on the side so now that you remove the fuse all you have to do is just bolt this um, relay onto the back part of your fuse box. So just remove that nut that is um, holding this one and you're gonna insert this over there. So the black cable I went ahead and fed it through the firewall already and you should be able to get it inside your cab. And also I went ahead and plugged the blue to the red one and I also plugged the, the red to the positive terminal of your battery. So moving towards the back um, part of the wiring, I would like to, you know, um, lay out all of the wiring first and then start to um, connect them. So what I did is I just connect this part right here. Red goes to red, black goes to black. And I'm gonna tape that with the electrical tape. You know what I'm gonna do is just gonna tuck them in here, going all the way down here. And by the way, I'm on the driver side. So for the passenger side, I'm just gonna find a way to route it and hide it. And this wire goes to the front. So once you've routed the wire from the back all the way to your um, 
engine bay all you have to do is just plug that wire to this one right here so once you're all done just try to pretty much check all of the connections and make sure you zip tie all of the wires in position so right now we're gonna be focusing on this part of the inner cab um, we're gonna just pry this whole panel out and locate for the um, plugs for this switch right here Just like that it's open and like I said we're gonna be locating the plug for this switch right here so once you're able to unplug this connector here now we're gonna be using the plug that um, Yoda Mafia provided just plug it like that and then the black wire that you routed from the engine bay goes to this part right here, which is the black wire as well. And these two red wires, you just have to go, in, go ahead and connect them. And this part goes to the original plug. Now all you have to do is just return and put this back in position. Or actually, before you put this back, make sure that it works. All right, so check this out, guys. So when I unlock the truck with the key fob, the rock lights turn on. And when I unlock it, I mean, when I lock it, it turns off. Now, if you want to unlock it with the door handle, lights are on and when you lock it the lights are off and the cool thing about it is you go inside and you turn on the engine and you close the door The lights are off. When you open the door, the lights are on. Turn off the engine, it stays on. There you go, guys. So, as I've shown you, the install is really, really easy. Um, the instruction guide that came with the product is pretty much direct to the point and you know if that's not enough there's um, Yoda Mafia has a video on YouTube on how to install it so you can't really go wrong in installing this one um, I like how it looks and I'll be honest I'll be showing them off on the freeway on side streets and all the other meets and whatnot but yeah like I said it's pretty easy I think the only thing that took me a while is to pretty much route the wires and make it look neat. But other than that, it's really easy, especially that it's a plug and play. You don't really have to cut any wires and all that. So I'll be putting their link down below. Um, shout out to Yoda Mafia again for such an amazing product. And like I said, I'll be putting their link below. And I hope you like this video. And if you do, please subscribe to my channel and that's pretty much it.